I'm really shocked right now. I'm just in the shock right now. The little boy's family is still trying to process the loss as friends and loved ones gather at a memorial marking the spot where vicious pit bulls claimed his life. He jumped into the fence and he wanted to pat the dogs and I guess he went to grab for something, a toy or something and they attacked him. The boy's aunt says the dogs attacked as he was picking up a toy Saturday night inside a fenced area on Clare Street. And we should take every measure that we can to make sure that this doesn't happen again. A city councilor is now pushing to ban all pit bulls in Lowell. Back in 2011, the city did adopt regulations on pit bull owners, but they were nullified when a new state law prohibited targeting certain breeds. It's about public safety for every and each individual in the city. Regulating the breed could prove difficult, but the boy's family is hoping for some kind of justice in the wake of his death. But I do believe that they should have some kind of consequences. Tonight, no charges have been filed in this case. That ordinance, it's expected to be introduced at a meeting here in Lowell tomorrow night. We're live in Lowell. John Atwater, WCVB News Center.